And welcome to Underground Horror Radio here on YouTube and also on uh, podunkradio.com and soon to be delayed uh, undergroundhorrorradio.com. So it is Halloween, finally. We are here. That's why the big pumpkin's there, that side. So uh, yeah, we're here at Halloween. It's like, what else can you do? We, we did everything. Uh, another Halloween season is gone. We made it. It's sad that it's over. I mean, it's not really over because I do this year round, but it's still October's over. So we have next year to look forward to. So we got two Halloween related items to unbox today. First things first a Sabrina, not technically the Teenage Witch. It's, uh, it's from the uh, Netflix show, Sabrina and uh, Salem here. From the uh, Chilling Tales of Sabrina, Adventures of Sabrina, and uh, which is cool because in the show her birthday is Halloween, and uh, I think it's cool. I like the show. It's it's dark, much like the Sabrina comics were, uh, with a little bit of tie into Riverdale. I guess they mention Riverdale as in the city or the town rather, not the not the show, because that's on the CW. But whatever. So. I am looking for, there is a comic book, Sabrina, as well, I want to get. That's from the Archie comics. Uh, but this is the one from the TV show. I haven't seen much out. I don't know why her hair is turning invisible. but There's not much else about it as far as other pops. On the back of it, it's just her and the cat. Uh, nothing to do with the ants or boyfriends or whatever. So that's, that's interesting. But you do have Salem. From the show with green eyes, which now he has black as doll's eyes. I can see through you. <gasps> um, and it's different. I mean, if you grew up in the 90s like I did, you had the TV show. Which was with, you know, Melissa Joan Hart. But this isn't bad for what it is. And uh, it's definitely a different take on the character. So it's not a bad show. Netflix is killing it. And it's not a bad little Funko Pop. And she stands up on her own and so does Salem. Or no, Salem doesn't, because of his tail. Just stupid. Why would they... Oh, okay, never mind. His tail was below his ass, so... He won't stand. Now he sits up. Cool. I was going to have a bitch fit. Anyway, that's that for that. Uh, not bad for... I only paid about... I don't know if I paid 12 bucks or not. I got it at Target. But I haven't seen it since, so... There's that. And now, the big finale. If you're thinking trick or treat, Sam, no, I can't. I don't have it yet. Could have bought one today. Money's tight, so I didn't get it yet. And they're releasing the ultimate figure from Nika uh, later on this month, uh, November. But I did score Halloween 2 Ultimate Michael Myers figure. Now, last year you saw me open up the 2018 Halloween movie titled Halloween. And that Michael Myers, 40 years later Michael Myers, which is a sequel to Halloween. This is the original sequel to Halloween from 1981, I believe, and uh, which is like people really believe it's a true sequel, which it, in a lot of ways it is. To me, I always said that, and I don't mind the 2018 movie at all. I like it. I have it. But to me, Halloween for me has always been in two parts, Halloween, Halloween 2. One story, two chapters. Because it takes place right away, and it's it's filmed in a similar fashion as the first one with John Carpenter. Michael's still wearing the same mask. It's cool. So, let's see what he looks like. Cool. Pretty sweet. He's got the Ben Tramer mask. And he's got the eyes bleeding mask. He's got the pumpkin. Let's crack him open. I'm, I'm slightly hesitant because I don't know really anywhere really to put them since and I should have fucking done this already but 
Whatever. All right. There we go. As usual, the box art is awesome because it's Sneaker. And oh, okay, cool. I believe that's the hospital. Looks like it. Or a, a room. Can't tell. Uh, I'll put this here. All right. Not gonna take him completely out yet, as I don't really want to do the time with it right now. But you know, but uh, he's got multiple heads, uh, masks, um, hands. So he's got multiple hands, wounded hands. He's got his assortment of weapons, different masks, which are different heads. Uh, but I want to show you the coolest thing. This is what sold me. If I can get it out. It's kind of a bitch, ain't it? This is what kind of sold me on it. So the pumpkin, this one comes with a jack-o'-lantern, but not from the first movie. This is from the opening. Not this part, because it's like that, but it's not. No, this is from the very, let's see if I can open it. The very opening of the movie as it has the pumpkin and it goes in the pumpkin and it opens up until a fucked up looking skull. Kind of like. It's a little more uh, than that, but I mean, come on. How cool is that? I mean, it's closed back up. So that's what kind of sold me. Because uh, that's what happens in the very opening of the movie. And I will say that when it comes to this sort of thing, Nika does put some effort in it. So there you have it. As far as everything looks on him, um, all the detail is there. The shot wounds and stuff from earlier that night. Mask is slightly a little bit dirty from on the ground. It's got more bullet holes in him. I'm sure he stands up because these usually do. And uh, he's got the different masks. So overall, I am extremely excited about this. And I will put it up on, uh, on Instagram soon. I will actually open it, open it in a bit. Uh, kind of crunched on time now, but... Happy Halloween. This is super cool. And I have more stuff to open up in November and December. Keep this going. Um, more pops. And I got a couple of actual Nika, you know, more figures. I just don't want to completely blow the load, as they say, in one, in one thing. Because then, you know, I'm nothing to open. So, thank you for watching. We'll see you later. Happy Halloween. Happy Harvest. Hope everybody has a safe night. I will be in downtown Clematis. If you want to come hang out, I will be there dressed up in a costume, more or less, which is basically me dressed up as me, but we'll see. Now, there will be a costume, but it doesn't look much different than what I normally wear. Whatever. Anyway, bye. Everybody have fun.